I have a memory problem. In my head, I imagine myself as a supermodel slash athlete. It's not until I see a photograph of myself that I flinch and realize the truth. No, do I really look like that? Now, uh, you can chalk this up to some amazing self-confidence, but for me, it's actually a problem. It's a problem because of a promise I made to myself on a beach in Hawaii 15 years ago. I was morbidly obese. Walking was difficult. Walking on sand was painful. And it was sand that brought me to my aha moment and a promise to myself to lose 100 pounds and run a marathon. Surprisingly, the marathon was the easy part. I finished my first marathon less than two years later and have run multiple since, and in the process, fell in love with running. And Lila, my anacronym for late-in-life athlete, was born. The 100 pounds, though, that's been a different story. That's been a promise I've kept breaking because of that image in my head. You see, anybody who has struggled with losing weight will tell you that the results on the scale come from what you put in your mouth and what you eat. And those choices, those choices of should you eat that, happen all day, every day. And when I'm out making choices about whether I should have lunch or that tasty snack, well, the scale isn't there. That picture of the supermodel slash athlete, well, she is, and she gives me permission, permission to just have that one thing, one thing choice at a time, and I was obese again. Clearly, I needed a different promise. So I went looking and started to think about what would actually motivate me and keep me on course to being the Lila, the late in life athlete that I really, really wanted to be. I also wondered if it was time to solve the real problem, that image in my head. I turned to 3D printing. I'd like to introduce you to 3D Lila. Yes, she's a 3D printed me. I cried the first time I saw her, more real to me than any photograph. But she's become this amazing tool. When I'm out at grocery stores and restaurants, I take her out and I look at her and I say, this is what you look like. What choice will you make now? And my new measure of success? Well, I get her reprinted every 90 days. And because she's a digital file, I know now down to the millimeter how much this is changing. And for me, that's the only measure of success that counts. With all of the technology that we have and solutions we have today to measure success on our own personal weight loss and fitness journeys, I think we should ditch the scale. I've turned to 3D printing to measure my success. What will you choose? Thank you.